Today we have a 2006 Chrysler Town & Country. It is a limited 3.8 motor. Uh, the customer accidentally backed into something the other day and broke the left rear tail light assembly. Um, so we're going to actually show you how to replace that. And it would actually be the same procedure for replacing the bulbs also. So we're going to show you this located and how to do it. I was in a little fender bender here. And the problem with this is uh, it's, it's actually still working, which is crazy. But uh, moisture gets in there, rain, snow, whatever. And that's going to wreak havoc on your electrical system. I mean, your bulbs are going to start blowing, they'll blow fuses, relays, and all that kind of stuff. And not only that, driving down the road at the wrong time of night, they might pull you over just to give you a, a report and repair on that. So it's something you should address fairly quickly. This would be the same way you'd actually change your bulbs. You put one in behind here like that. actually has tabs right there on the side like that you just pop it out it comes out oh, this is actually already disconnected which is kind of nice this has a lock on it that has to be pushed over right there but for whatever reason this is already disconnected uh, if you are going to change your bulbs all you have to do is push in on these right here like that and it pulls out and you replace the bulb but we don't need to do that we got a whole new different outfit this one actually came from a salvage yard for like five bucks. You could actually get them on Amazon, I think for 20 or 30. So they're not that expensive. And it looks a heck of a lot better. So we're gonna reinstall this new one. I'm gonna plug it in real quick. And I'm gonna double check it to make sure it's working. I'm gonna slide this down on top of it. Just like that. And you've got this lock right here you push in there. It was a little harder to see the lock on that right there. So you gotta pull it over like this, then you can push down and pull it off. Um, once you snap it back in place, all you gotta do is click that over like that and it locks it. And before I button it back in, I'm just gonna turn the turn indicator on and make sure it's working. So we're just double checking. You can see it's working. Of course, the moisture can't get in there now. It's a sealed unit. So I'm gonna put that lock in place, which is that little red tab we gotta push over. You can hear it do it. Put this right there, snap it in place like that, put it like that, put that in like that, put this other one in. All you have to do is push this down like that to lock it in place. So that's all it takes to replace the tail light or the tail light bulbs on a 2006 Chrysler Town & Country with a 3.8 motor.